the early 20s, aeronauts strove to perfect a strange windmill on wheels called the helicopter. This French model flew for only a few precarious moments and never got as high as an elephant's eye. Yet its achievement was a new world record and an important advance in aviation. Pile for the wood, she's running wild. A pilot could easily lose his head if he ran in the wrong direction. Early helicopters were dangerous. Careful, men, watch out for tricks. In Detroit, the first umbrella helicopter makes its bow. As light as lead and cast iron could make her, this undergrown carousel was supposed to jump into the air. Try this on your next hangover. Back in France, there appeared a new kind of copter driven by a pair of oversized pinwheels. This aerial bucking Bronco had the stability of an intoxicated chorus girl and required a ground crew skilled in the 100-yard dash. A bag and a pilot were added for control. Hmm, some control. Just let her loose and where she goes, nobody knows. They called her the flying sausage, but to that perspiring ground crew, she was just a lot of baloney. This is how they got airsick back in 1921.